What's up everybody, Righteous Noob here, and welcome back to my playthrough of Undertale. In the last episode, we spared Papyrus, and in this episode, we're going to continue on to the next area of the Underground. Uh, is it going to be just as ominous switching areas as it was last time? Because if so... Oh, okay. Hey, you're that kid from earlier. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell me, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> a flower, huh? All it is my life validation is explaining the Echo Flower. No one can know. Never trust a flower. That's one of the constants of this world. Never trust a flower. That's one of the constants of this world. That's a little interesting. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Waterfall checkpoint. Alright. Hmm. You know what? Let's just go. We can talk to Sand some other time. This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items while they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. <laughs> Instead of a box enthusiast like before. I swear I saw something behind that rushing water. Behind the rushing water, huh? Hmm, okay. Well, let's check behind said rushing water. After we organize this box, use the box. Yes. Um... I'm going to save the butterscotch pie, because I don't really need that right now. And, uh, I think that's good. Okay, so... Aha! There is something behind the rushing water. There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Sure! You got the old tutu. So, let's see. Info. Old tutu. Armor, defense 10. Finally, a protective piece of armor. Um, yeah. Because I guess that is better than a band-aid, a ribbon, and a bandana. So let's equip that. We equip the old tutu. So we get an extra five defense. That's nice. And then we can put that old, that uh, manly bandana in the box. <coughs> and then we can continue on from here. Oh, almost got pushed off. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark and ominous. Wonder who that is. Oh, hey, Papyrus. here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I told you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I, did I capture them? Well, no. I tried very hard on that, but in the end, I failed. What? You don't want to take the human soul yourself. But Undyne, you don't have to destroy them, you see? You see? Oh, you mean we need a papyrus. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Oh, well that's not good. What the? Oh, that can't be good. Oh no, that looks awful sharp. Oh yeah, because that's not creepy at all. Man, that was too close. Hey, it's that kid. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous. What did you do to get her attention? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Ugh. Okay, well... Let me officially welcome you. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Well, looks like we finally made it to Waterfall. Where four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. So, pick them up with Z, and throw them with Z. It's easy enough to understand, 
And like that thing said, if you line four of them up, bam, they form a little bridge you can walk on. Whoa, monsters. Aaron flexes in. All right, so here's Aaron. Aaron, attack 24, defense 12. This seahorse has a lot of HP, horsepower. Haha, <laughs> very funny game. All of his attacks are hard to dodge at the bottom of this box. That's nice. Check all you want, wink. The game is right, those are way harder to dodge. Those would be way harder to dodge at the bottom of the screen. Oh, and I still got it. Splashing you playfully. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to flex. You flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you, too. Flexing contest? Okay. Flex more. He's launching water unevenly from the side. I'm going to assume that sweating is ready for your next flex. So just keep flexing. You flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Attack increases for you, too. Nice. I won't lose, though. Again, with that moderately easy to dodge flexing attack. Ah! As I get. Aaron is ready for my next flex. You flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. You won. You earned 0 XP and 30 gold. Okay. There's a sign over there. You can actually line these up here, and they should form a bridge that you can walk on to use to read the sign. Let's uh, throw that there. Yep, there's room for one more. Congratulations! You failed the puzzle. Well, that's not very nice. Error is made, the Bell Blossom can bring the bridge seeds back to where they started. Oh, that's convenient. Now, okay, I know there's something if you go off to, like, the side here. But you gotta do it just right for it to work. Bench. What's Echo Flower say? I just wasn't ready for the responsibility. There's a lone quiche sitting underneath this bench. Will you take it? I'll take it. You got the abandoned quiche. Abandoned quiche heals 34 HP. A psychologically damaged spinach egg pie. That's that's lovely. Okay, there's more flowers here. Okay, so now we gotta th throw them down. Uh, this one always- wait, I think I gotta throw them up this way. Now, I never seem to get the weapon from this area, because I can never really find it. There's nothing behind that waterfall. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty toot. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty toot? Um, yes, I was not wearing a dusty toot. So you aren't wearing a dusty toot. Got it. My friend, so I trust you 100%. Have a nice day. Oh, I know I feel bad about lying to Pyrus. Whatever. Wishing room. There's a lot of stuff here that I don't feel like talking to. A lot more, more monsters. Washua shuffles up. And oh, look at the time. Uh, I think that's enough for now. So on the next episode of Undertale, we will uh, fight Washua, of all people. Um, until then, see ya.